Hey, I'm Ed. Welcome back to my channel, Kiwi Ed and Oz. Okay, so today, for my video, I'm going to be trying out three very, very Australian proteins. I've got kangaroo, emu, and crocodile. I have to admit, the one I'm most worried about is the crocodile. I mean, that eats meat. So is it going to change the way it tastes? I don't know. Oh, I'm going to do that one last. I'm going to do that one last. Okay, so these are all very lean um, sources of protein. They are roughly 20 bucks a kilo each. So, yeah, they're not the cheapest, but I wanted to try something different. Mix it up a little, see if I like different kinds of protein. Um, all I've done is cook them in um, butter and a little bit of olive oil, just so the butter didn't burn. But as you can see, with the crocodile, the butter did get a little bit toasty. <laughs> But smells good. All right, so let's get into it. Oh, I've got salt as well. I haven't done anything to them but the butter. Right, we're going to try the kangaroo first. Oh, I may have slightly overcooked it. Just a little bit. It did say you could have it rare, medium rare. And I may have, yeah, a little bit overcooked. That's nice, that's just like steak. Ooh. Ooh, you know what that's like? Need salt. Sorry, that needs salt. Give me a second. That's like um uh venison. A little bit like venison, very gamey. Oh, it's nice. Kind of try it with a bit of salt. Mmm, mmm. Kangaroo is awesome. Seems a bit strange, eh, that the Aussies would eat their uh, national animal, but we're in Australia. Mmm, <laughs> that's really good. I'm not sure exactly where the steak's from. It didn't say on the packet, but it tastes really good. And I got that at Woolies. What did I say? $20 a kilo. Try it out if you want. It's not bad. Okay, and I've got beer because I like beer. Again, I think I've got Stearman's Blonde. Yep, Stearman's Blonde. Mm. Awesome. Okay, I'm just going to pan that down a little. Is that better? No. <laughs> okay, so next, I'm going to try out the emu. A little bit of salt. I have tried ostrich, so I'm guessing it might be very similar, but that was years ago. I may have overcooked this slightly too. I didn't know how to cook emu because it's it's a bird, right? So are you supposed to cook it all the way through? It was very dark. It looked like, um, it just looked like steak. So hopefully I cooked it right. I'm not sure what I think of that. Give me a sec, I'll try another bit. Darling, you'll have to try this emu too. I'm not sure what I can say it kind of tastes like. I think I overcooked it. Kind of tastes a little bit like turkey. You know, the drumsticks? Um, I think this was a breast steak. And it was big. It was like, maybe that round. Oh, can't see it. It was about that round. Um, a bit like turkey. A little tiny bit. And yeah, I'm not cutting it right because it's going all weird. Can you see that? So that's the colour it is. It's very dark. A little bit like turkey. Safe knife. Two thumbs up for Australian protein so far. Mmm. Mmm, that's good. Mm. And I'm going to have me some soda. So today I've got, this is just sparkling water, and it's flavoured pineapple and orange. It's really good. It's got no sugar. I like it. I think it tastes awesome. But it's not cold. 
You can smell the pineapple and the orange on it. It's really good. It's just fizzy water with a little bit of pineapple and orange. It's good. Okay. Last one. The crocodile. Oh, please don't taste weird. Just gonna put a bit of salt on that. I've got Himalayan pink rock salt because it's yum. Okay. <sighs> Gotta psych myself up for this one. Oh my goodness, it's wow. It was very white when I put it in um in the frying pan. I thought it was like fish. But when you cut through it, it's um it's a bit more like chicken. Please don't taste like fishy chicken. Okay, a little 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 bit, little bit, little bit. No, I've got to eat more of that. I can't. I do have a slight cold in my. I've got the sniffles. Hmm. The meat is a lot firmer than I than I expected. I thought it would flake apart a little bit like fish. Okay, okay. What is that? Definitely has its own distinct flavour. Doesn't taste like chicken. Definitely doesn't taste like fish. It's not fishy at all. <laughs> I totally soaked it in butter, so yeah, couldn't taste it all buttery. But hey, can never have enough butter, right? Okay, another little bit because I can't. I'm not sure what it tastes like. Okay, smell, smell, smell. No, it doesn't. Doesn't smell fishy. <laughs> I had a really weird thought. Maybe it smells like people, but no. This crocodile is farmed. <laughs> um, it's kind of a bit like chicken, but the muscles in it are different. It's like the, um, you know how you can cut open an eel and put it on the line and put the salt on it and it goes like that? That's what the inside of this looks like. I wasn't like sure what to expect with this. It's a little, it's nice. I'm not saying it's yuck. It's actually a lot better than I was expecting. I thought it would be like fishy chicken. It's actually really good. And of course, if you don't like it, you can always smother it in chili sauce. And that makes everything taste great. Mmm. That's actually quite nice. No, I enjoyed that. That's good. If you didn't know it was crocodile, you'd think it was chicken. With a strange texture. Because it does have a little bit of a strange texture to it. But it's good. It's not bad at all. Okay, so kangaroo, emu, crocodile. Would I get these again? I, I really like the kangaroo. That's, um, kind of tastes ven like venison. Oh, it's yum. And I, the last time I had kangaroo, it was mince, and it was like, whoa. But the steaks are really, really good. The emu, I'll have to look up how to cook it, because I'm pretty sure I overcooked it. And as you can see, it's a really dark meat, so I probably could have um, cooked it a little bit less. But it's a bird, so, you know. And like chicken, you've got to cook it all the way through. So I may have slightly overdone it a little bit. That was actually really nice. A bit like turkey, but a bit stronger. <laughs> you know, it's a bigger bird. Of course it's going to be stronger. And what surprised me the most, the crocodile. It actually tastes really good. It's just got a strange um, texture. It's Yeah. You definitely know you're not eating chicken. That's for sure. But it tastes good. It's pretty awesome, actually. Hmm. Maybe a bit more like monkfish, because monkfish is very fleshy, so. But that's good. Alright, so that's my uh, opinion on the very Australian proteins. 
I hope you guys like this videos. Alright, I'm outies. Laters.